Hey guys, what's going on? Today we're making rotisserie chicken wings on the GMG Daniel Boone. Got me a new toy here from Napoleon. It's a rotisserie basket. Check it out. I'm gonna slap it on the GMG. It's gonna fit. It's gonna be fun. We're gonna flip some wings around. It's gonna be money, like I always say. Stick around. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. So the cool thing I like about my Green Mountain grills is they already come with these pre-mounted brackets for your rotisserie. Got one here. Slide the little plate back. And then over here, there's another bracket. Your inside bracket's already here. Just drop in your plate like that. Get your other plate over here. Head out of the way. So, we're going on like that, and rotisserie is set up. You got to get your rod, slide your rod through, in, and you're done. There's a collar that's got to be put on this side over here for it to rotate on. We'll put that together in a minute. You'll see that. That's a simple, easy setup for your GMG rotisserie. The only one that has it, you know. Traeger doesn't have it. Rec Tech, Pit Boss, I don't care. GMG is the only one. Get you one. What we're using today is the Napoleon Rotisserie Kid Rotisserie Basket from Napoleon Grills. It'll fit any rotisserie out there. I picked this up at Barbecue Outfitters here in San Antonio. It's a simple two piece designed basket. Works pretty cool. We're going to give it a shot. Basic, it's got this hinge point or hinge rod here. Two little clips on the outside there. Just gonna clip them together. Go down with it. Put a lock. Like so. And then you put your wings or whatever you want to put in the basket. Clip it tight. To the laps. That's it. And then we'll get it on the rod. Simple design. Come through. Like so. Turn your keys down on both sides and it's gonna turn it's gonna be money all right let's get these wings seasoned up we'll get them filled up and on here okay all right so the first thing we're gonna do is get our baskets I got them here we're gonna season them up with some nonstick cooking spray and I'm just gonna spray them with some canola oil on the inside right hopefully the wings won't stick as much so just get those sprayed lightly in the basket. Then we're gonna come in with our wings. And today we're cooking, I got some flats and I got some drumettes. All right, said so we got flats, we got drumettes. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna kinda space them in here a little bit. I'm gonna flip them all around. And I'm gonna put just a light coat of seasoning on them. I'm afraid that once they start to rotate and spin, that this rub's gonna come off. But we're gonna we're gonna play around with that. Today we're using my new Texas Freebird chicken seasoning. Alright? Stuff is delicious. It's money. We're gonna spray them with some duck fat, okay? My bad. Got some duck fat going on. Come back with our Texas Freebird. All right. I'm gonna flip them around a little bit. One more time. Like so. A little more duck fat. Freebird. Drumettes. And get our drumettes. Throw them in here. So, duck fat. Some of that 
free bird. And then we'll see if I may add some more rub as we're cooking. Let's go a little heavier on these guys here. See what they do. Now, to close this up, bring this over, flip them together like so. Get that locked into place like so. All right, get our rod in. Through. Like come through. Tie these down. All right, let's get this on the GMG. All right, got our GMG fired up to 375 degrees. So you can see I put the little collar on this side. Go in here like so. Put that air on the motor there. Get in, turn her on. There she goes. First time doing this guys. We're gonna see how it works. We're gonna see how it works. Rotisserie basket on the GMG. All right, we're gonna let it run. Actually, I'm gonna do it. Let it go about 30 minutes. Take a sneak peek. I'll bring you back at that time. All right, all right. We are about 45 minutes in. Take a look. Love that GMG. Got that little window going on. Take a look. Wings just to flip in. Let's go ahead and open it up, see what it looks like. Oh, yeah, look at that color. That duck fat puts a good color on them. Any bird, any birdie bird. Just turn it around nicely. All right, we're going to give it another half an hour. Come back and take a look. All right, guys, hey, wings are done. Next step is I'm going to get them in a bowl. We're going to put some Frank's hot sauce on them. We're going to get them back on the grill, crank it up to 400, and finish them off. All right, let's get that done. Let's go ahead and get these wings in this bowl, get them dumped in here really good. Gonna go ahead and give them a little uh, Texas Freebird. Get a little dusting on there before we put our Frank's Red Hot Sauce. This seasoning is money. And top with this Frank's Red Hot Sauce, wing sauce, it's excellent. Just get it on there, probably about a quarter cup or so, a little splash around. And uh, we'll get it on the smoker and give it a little toss, flip them around, get a good little coating on there, and we'll get them back on the GMG, All right? All right, we got our wings sauced. I'm gonna go ahead and put them back on here, increase the temperature to 400 degrees, and just leave them on for about 20 minutes. all right guys that's it we're done chicken wings on the rotisserie cannot beat it first time i've ever done it that way and i tell you what i was pretty pretty excited about it it came out pretty cool i'm gonna have to try something else in that little basket that napoleon basket retails for about 62 dollars not too bad of a deal i mean stainless steel We'll see how it is to clean. I haven't cleaned it, but I'm going to have it soaking in some water, some dish dish soap, you know. And uh, hopefully we'll uh, we'll have an easy clean on it, go from there. Other than that, uh, 
Texas Freebird, new chicken rub, amazing on those wings. I've actually had it on late quarters before, so it's not too bad. Let's go ahead. I don't know if you're uh, team drum or team flat, but I'm team drum myself, so let's go ahead and give her a little bite. Heck yeah. That is a wing. Mm hmm. Skin is not as crispy as a fried ring, of course, but it is bite through skin, as you can see there. Fit through it pretty good. That's it. Guys, if you're new to my channel, I appreciate the subscription. Check it out. You got other videos. Hit that thumbs up. It counts. It matters for something. All right. Y'all be cool. Y'all be good. Catch you on the next one. Have a good one. Later.